Hey everybody, uh, making a video here, basically a farewell video to the 2021 GT 26 inch Pro Performer with the raspberry color. Um, decided to trade this bike and get a 29 inch GT Pro Performer, um, the World Tour. Uh, with the baby blue and white uh, color scheme. Um, it's kind of hard to let go of this bike. It's been an awesome bike. Uh, I guess just for my size. It, it fits me well. 20, 26 inch for 6 foot 2 person. Um, it's definitely rideable. It's not anything there that's bad, but... I um, just kind of decided that I would like to get a 29 inch version of this bike. Um, I've had this bike for about a month. Um, my son, he's 12, he's been riding it, fits him well. Kind of talked to him and, you know, showed him the other bike. And this basically sounds like we're going to go ahead and pull the trigger on that. Um, there's a local shop, which I've mentioned in my videos before, which I'm kind of get annoying as saying local shop, but anyway, um, it's a great shop. The guy just got in a 29 inch world tour. Um, so I kind of contacted him and asked if he'd want to do a trade. And he said that he'd be willing to work something out. Um, I probably have to pay a little extra money to to do the tray just because that one's brand new. I don't think it's been test ridden yet. It's been hanging. He built it and hung it on the, built it and hung it up on the racks. So, um, yeah, I'll probably have to pay a little bit a difference to, to do the swap. But, um, I mean, that one was, I think 950 if you order it new. This one was basically a hundred dollars cheaper you know, when you, when you bought it new. So probably have to pay at least a hundred, maybe 200 more dollars. So it kind of seems like a little bit of a, a loss in money, but hey, if it makes me happy, then I'm all about it. I do really love this raspberry color scheme or radberry color scheme. Different sites say different things. Um, everything on this bike is the same on that bike other than just the size. I think the forks are a little different on that bike. I'm basically the same, but there's some minor nuances, difference. Um, the gearing's the same, 36 tooth front sprocket, 16 tooth freewheel, uh, brakes, everything on, on the bikes are the same, except for the tires are different. These are the, the GT ones that, uh, just have the, the letters GT all throughout the tires. Uh, the other ones are the, the GT smoothies, uh, so those are the white hard to take basically no tread uh the other one's got a white seat that's got the black seat the other one's got uh polished chromoly silver handlebars this one's got the same colorway as the as the frame uh this one's got the black and my son got a little scuff right there on the it's a little dirty too but a little scuff right there when he kind of rubbed it on the side of the wall but anyway um so yeah everything's basically the same uh the, except for the other bike's got white grips white gt grips this one's got the black uh this one has the black and silver or black and gray uh, pads that one's got white blue and the gt uh lettering is yellow on that bike i'm sure most of you have seen it um black pedals just like this one uh everything's basically the same but yeah, I gotta, gotta say farewell to this thing. Um, I don't know. I mean, it's kind of hard to, to think about, but what do you guys think? I mean, do you think that'd be a, a good trade? I mean, I know this is a cool bike. Um, that one's also cool. So I guess you give a little, take a little, you know, what, just whatever you think makes your, your life better and makes you happy. Sometimes it's just about getting new stuff or you know, that impulse that you want something and not every time you should do it, but uh, I think I'm gonna do it anyway. So yeah, the one thing about this bike, that's pretty neat. 
Uh, we got a we got an autograph here. Uh, it's a Bill Allen signature. Uh, I don't know if any of you are familiar with Bill Allen, but he's uh, in the old 80s movie Rad, uh, that BMX movie. It's a pretty cool movie uh, for back in the day, but uh, he was locally here at a bike convention, um, and I brought in the, the, the outer casing of the pad to um, sign it, so he did. So unfortunately, when I do do the bike swap, um, I won't have the signature anymore. Um, so that's a kind of a big drag, but hopefully if he comes back, I'll have him sign the other pads. And I would just swap out the pads, but then it takes away from the originality of this bike. And I do like the colors of the pads on the other bike. Um, so yeah, if any of you are curious about, any of you are curious about that 29 inch world tour, you just look it up, 29 inch, uh, you know, GT Pro Performer and you should be able to come across the, the baby blue one. Uh, that's the one that I'm gonna be getting when I do get it. I'll make a video on that for you, kind of showcase that one. There's a couple cool things I wanna do to that, kind of, you know, and I'll, I'll kind of go over the progress with that uh, once I get it and do some slight modifications. Probably take the dice off here, put it on those, you know, stupid stuff like that. Uh, might end up getting yellow pedals to match the yellow that'll be on the GT. Uh, maybe a yellow chain uh, so I'll kind of be white yellow and blue um, but when I get the bike I'll I'll uh, kind of showcase it for you guys and you guys will be able to kind of see see what I'm talking about um, yeah I mean I like this bike a lot it's got some really cool parts kind of you know got some top of the line parts um, high flange hubs uh, that you know just nice welds on here uh, the colorway on this one's pretty sweet and that light's annoying but you got to have it on it when you want to ride at night this bike's probably only got oh gosh I don't know 10 miles maybe maybe 15 I've only ridden around a couple local trails here uh, you know basically that's about it um, so yeah I mean let me know what you guys think if you think that uh, it's a good trade or if I should trade or if I should shouldn't trade you know, let me know in the comments. I mean, probably by the time anybody gets around to watching my videos, I got a small channel. Uh, probably be too late. I probably have already traded it, but it'd be nice to kind of see what everybody's opinion is after the fact uh, of the of the swap here. So, but yeah. So anyway, this is what we got. This is what we're. This is what my plan is. So yeah, I don't know, leave it in the comments below what you think, um, and uh, we'll kind of go from there. Have a good day, and we'll catch you on the next video. Peace.